gonna, I think, do that. We're on. We should be good. Hey, what's going on, everybody? Welcome to another Sunday night, Sunday fun day, or you want to call it Sunday training. Uh, in this video tutorial that we're going to be doing, we're going to be talking about the secrets of how you can get more traffic faster than a blog. So I know most of you want to do blogging, so I'm going to give you like the shortcut version where you can get more traffic and more things and more eyeballs to whatever products or services that you want to do. So if you're brand new to this group, I want to say welcome. My name is Andre. I'm originally from oh, Jamaica. I was gonna say my name, and, now, <laughs> and now we're living in Massachusetts. No, we're, we're not. Beautiful wife. We're living in Vermont. Oh yeah, we're in Vermont now. See? Hey, I'm that, that's what happens when you go all day and you don't get time to do anything. So introduce yourself, babe. I'm Brittany. I'm originally from Massachusetts, but we are now living in Vermont yeah. for two years now. Yeah. Two full years. <laughs> two full years. Exactly. This past week, we yeah. celebrated two years in our house. So Yeah, we're loving it. And everything was achieved through online business. And that's why we want to share this with you. So whatever goals you have, you can, you know, maybe it's uh maybe it's just to get some extra gas gas money or grocery money or Maybe you want to travel more. Maybe you want to get a house. I don't know. Maybe you want to give somebody something amazing. Now we're going to jump. There's going to have a lot to cover, so we're not going to waste any time. So let's get ready to rock and roll. So first things first, I'm going to show you how you can find trends. Um, and also I'm going to go into the Google Analytics for a little bit. I'm using a different browser. On my other browser, I can log into everything. Not sure what happened. But we're going to try to see if I can actually share my screen so you can see it. So make sure you stay all the way to the end because I'm going to share with you how you can, if, if you're a person who's not able to write a blog or come up with content or things like that, I'm going to share with you a method that you can get started without even using your own content. So everything that I'm going to share with you in this video is something that you can set up and just get started right away. So if you don't use this information, well, it's just going to sit in this group or on my YouTube channel and someone who is going to be interested is going to use it. So let's jump right into it. First thing that we're going to do, I have my list right here, is we're going to go to Google Trend. So we're going to go to Google Trend and I'm going to click on here where to share screen. Now what I'm going to share, we're going to go into this tab right here. We're going to go to Google. Bada bing, bada boom. There we go. All right. So right now we're on Google. So a lot of people don't know that um, Google tell you exactly what people are looking for. And you can't um, start a blog or start what I'm about to share with you without doing your research. So you want to make sure you do your research. You want to do, do all those things. And then are we frozen? Are you sure? It is on my end. Okay, hang on one Time second. Time out just to make sure we're not frozen. Let's come on one, one second. Let's make sure that everything is good. All right. No. So it's shown on okay. my end. All right. I don't know why it froze. So on your Cecilia end. to the rescue. I don't know why it was frozen on my end. Sorry right, about yes. that. I just wanted to make sure we didn't do all this. <laughs> Sorry about that one minute trying to figure out, hey, this is what technology, you know, this is what happened when you do a live video or you record a video. A lot of people edit videos. I don't. I like to keep it raw and just be upfront with people. Back to the Google. So when we're on Google, Google is gonna tell you exactly what to search for. All these search engines, Yahoo, Microsoft, um, there's another one that is called Bing. Microsoft Bing is the same thing. Uh, Google, they're gonna show you all this information. So if you wanna know what's hot and what's trending and what you need to talk about, so you get more traffic, that's gonna be easier for you. Most people think that, okay, well, I want to talk about flowers. All right, great. You can talk about flowers. But did you do any research on flowers? No, because you love it. That's why you're going to write a blog or whatever about it. That's not the right way of going about it. So make sure you do your research. You got to know what, what people are searching for. So that way you don't waste time trying to figure things out. So here's a, a, little, a, a little hack that I want to share with you. If you, if you go on Google and you type in Google Trend, once you type in Google Trend and you search, Google have this 
um, website or app or whatever you want to call it right here on the first page. As you can see, there's over 1 billion searches for Google Trend. It's crazy. So right here, if you click on Google Trend, once you click on Google Trend, it's going to take you to the actual Google Trend website. As you can see on the top left corner where it says Google Trend right here, that's Google Trend. Explore what the world is searching. So exactly what I just said. You got to search for what the world is searching because you don't want to go against what they're not searching for. That's going to, if you're writing blog, you want to do the same thing too. So what are they searching for? As you can see, <laughs> of course, Kardashian, Kim Kardashian and Taylor Swift. That's what people are searching for right now. That's what they're interested in. They're talking about the World Cup. They're also talking about American football because you know it's football season right now. When you're watching this video, it's football season. If you're probably not watching it another time, it's not football seasons. And it says showing example one of three. So if I want to look at more, I could just click on here and people are searching for Fortnite. That's gaming. People are searching for uh, ramen, shuba, and pho. I don't even know what this is, but people are searching for it. So if you want to, if you don't know what this is, simple go search on Google to go find out. We're not going to find out tonight because I really don't care what it is. <laughs> but if you want to know, go search for it. People are searching for cupcakes. Oh my goodness. Look at that. That's crazy. That's crazy. Cupcakes. This is what people are searching for right now on August the 21st that I'm shooting this video. So people are searching for this. So you want to go with trends and what people are looking for. Why do I say that? Because it's going to be better for you and you can start gaining traction. If you scroll down here, you can see the latest stories and insights. Women, NBA people are looking for. Pride, 2022. LGBT. You got rainbow wig. You got rainbow necklace. You got rainbow earrings. All these things. So if you want to create a e-commerce website or whatever some of you call it or blog around it, now you know exactly what to search for. All right. If you scroll down a bit, you see all this recent, recently trending, House of Dragons, PG, uh, PSG, Albert, I don't know who that is, um, Real, Social Dad versus Bar Barcelona, Man City United, that's soccer, Arsenal, all that stuff. So come over here and just start searching. You can see, you can go back in time and see what people searched for in 2021, 2020, 2019, 18, all that good stuff. So when you come on here, let's say I want to search for cupcake since cupcake is hot. So let's go to go with cupcake right now. So we're going to go with cupcake. And when I type cupcake in, you're going to see the graph. Over here, you see where it says in the United States, that's what people are searching for past 12 months, all categories, web searches. So here, as you can see, these are trends. This is a trend of what people are searching for. This District of Columbia, Maryland, New Jersey. That's what these people are searching for. I don't know. Maybe they got some cupcake thing going on <laughs> over in those states. And if you look to the left, you will see the related topics. The Mask Singer, 2048 topic, 2048 video game. And over here, Banana Split Mask Singer. Who is cupcake on Mask same. It obviously has something to do that is not food related. Yeah, I think. <laughs> yeah, it's not food related. So even though it says cake or cupcake, it has to do something with here. So when you see over here where it says breakout, breakout means that this is what is trending right now. It's a breakout. That's what people are searching for. So they're looking for all these things. All this right here, as you can see, breakout. So if I right now should create a YouTube video or a TikTok video, whatever video around this topic, I can tell you right now that I'm going to get views because people are looking for, people are searching for. Same thing, if you create a blog, people are going to search for this too. So you're probably going to get into the search engine a little bit quicker. So I'm going to click on this. So I'm just going in a little bit detail to show you how this thing works. Right here, they have a spike. So they had a spike back in 2021. Who's Cupcake Mask? Right. As you can see, it's going. There's another spike again. People in Oklahoma are searching for these things. And as you can see, right, banana split food, that's food. Some people are searching for that stuff. Now, once you find this, you want to do a lot of research. You got to research and you got to find things. You can also do a comparison. 
you can do a comparison as well. So I'm just gonna go back for a little bit. Is that how I do that? And then you could see, yeah, no, no, no. I don't think it will come up. So let's say I'm gonna search for dog. So I'm gonna search for dog. So if I'm gonna talk about dogs and let's say I wanna go between, you know, different type of dogs, you'll see down here, these are breakout. The power of a dog, power of the dog, dog movie 2022. This right here is also good as well. So if I type in dog, I don't wanna type in cat. What people are talking right now? They're talking about dog or they're talking about cat? So on the blue, you see where it says more people are talking about dogs right now. Sorry, cat lovers, but this is what people are talking about. Cat, well, not quite sure. You know, cat is down here. I'm not saying people are not talking about cats, but as you can see, there's a trend of what they're looking for right now. Maybe sometime later on this year, there'll be more cats, more than dogs. People over here are searching for these things. Do you see what I'm trying to share with you? Let me know in the comments if you see what I'm trying to share with you. Drop a one in the comment. If you're watching the replay, drop a two if you're watching the replay. All right, so you can see what people are searching for. Now that you found this website, you have to go do your research. I can't tell you what you gotta do. You gotta have to come up with these things by yourself. So I'm giving you the tools and the resources. You're gonna have to go find what's gonna work for you. So whatever you love, go search for it, go find it. That's me giving you permission. Most of you are sitting on your hands right now and you're waiting for a nudge. Go out there, go search for stuff. I'm giving you these things. All right, now that we're all over this, I'm gonna go back here and I'm going to remove this. Now I'm gonna show you another one, which is also called, the, I'm gonna share this. Let me put this back up here. I'm gonna go back and I'm gonna share with you. So I'm gonna go to Google. So now you found about, uh, these are tools that I use, okay? So if you think I'm sitting here twiddling with my thumbs, this is what we do every day. Now I'm gonna go to Google Analytics. So Google Analytics, it is free. These websites are free. They're there to use. With so, powerful information. Right? So if I go to Google Analytics right now, it's going to come up. And this will probably won't show you any analytics because I'm using a, a different, I'm using a, a, a different thing. Um, so you can go where it says start measuring. When you click on start measuring, you can put in a name of the account that you want to. So a name, you know, it's going to require a name of an account. Um, this, I do believe you have to have a Google AdSense, but I think you can sign up for it. It says require accounts can contain more than one ID. So you can put a name of the account. It says require all that good stuff. Um, let me see if I can go on to my other account. Let me see if I can remove this and I'm going to see if I can log in somewhere else. Bear with me here. Do you have anything you want to say, Brett? I know you looking all pretty. <laughs> all right, guys, I'm in my pajamas. <laughs> I am not looking all pretty. <laughs> right. Okay. So this is showing up Chrome. I want to go over, not Chrome, but I want to go to Safari. Why Safari? Oh, there we go. Oh, man. Man, oh, man. Okay, so it won't work. So that won't work. It says it won't work on, it won't work on Chrome. Okay, so they say the software work, work on Chrome. So I use Chrome, um, not Chrome. I use Safari a lot. They only work on Chrome. So sorry, I can't show you guys, you know, my stats and all those things. It would be a lot of crazy numbers and everything. But you get the idea what I'm what I'm trying to say. You just got to sign up for this. It is free. Go sign up for it. Um, if you don't know how to use it, I'm sure there's going to be a wonderful video on YouTube <laughs> explaining how to use it. So go out there and go, you know, go use it. I'm giving you permission. But just go set this up, you know. Put in all the information here. Once you set it up, you will see all the – you won't see any data. It's Of course, it's going to be zero. But once you start using it, you can connect your YouTube on it. You can connect – Facebook on it. You can also connect your um, blog on it as well. And you can read different stats and all that stuff. So um, 
this software when we use on uh, Safari, you know, they don't want you to be great, but I'm telling you to go be great. All right, moving on. So what I wanted to share with you, one of the, one of the things how you can get a lot of traffic is you want to use this website. And this website, that it's a, it's a very known little, I don't like to call things secret. I call it gem. This is a gem that people use and a lot of people don't share this with you, right? But I wanna share with you. So we're gonna go here and this website that I wanna share with you is medium.com. Now you probably heard about it before. Some of you probably don't. Medium is a great way how you can start your blogging process. Now, if some of you want to start a blog from scratch, go for it. I'm not saying no start blogging. What I'm sharing with you is here, you're going to get eyes on to you. you you're going to get um, you're going to get more views. So for like quicker. Ex yeah. So, for example, like, oh, gosh, I don't even know how many years ago I was doing a blog. And let me tell you, I tried medium once a couple years ago. It's just even, it's way easier to me to navigate. I don't, I don't even know. I forget what I even did my blog through, but medium is just like the way to go. And you can even search something on Google. And a lot of the time, whatever that keyword is that you're searching, a medium article is going to pop up. So it makes you even more well known on Google rather than your actual blog. There you go. See, you explain things even in English. I don't know how to explain it. <laughs> I just know how to do a lot of stuff. All right, so here's Medium. Medium.com. It is free. Um, they have a membership thing that you could pay for as well. You Wait, what was that member. keyword you just used? It's free? Yeah. Oh, man. <laughs> a free. lot of you in this group are all about the free, so we're giving away our free secrets, okay? <laughs> all right. I know. Like, yeah. So you could sign up. Uh, just go here where it says get started. When you get started, you could sign up with Google. You can sign up with your Facebook, you can sign up with an email. So I'm just gonna do a quick little thing real quick. Um, I just created an account right now. Um, let me see if I can, let me see if I have an old email that I can use. Can you remember what I got a lot of emails that I can use. Let me see if that one is used before. Your email, enter your email address to create. Um, does this work? Let's see. All right, it says check your inbox for the good stuff. You should uh, really use this again. <laughs> yeah, you, you need to. I use it. I don't use it as much as before, but I, I still get a lot of sales and a lot of, I get a lot of people, man. A lot of customers from this thing because it's evergreen. People are already searching for it. So even like the stuff I did a few years ago, if someone searches a keyword, most likely one of my articles is going to come up. And I can tell you right now, if you actually go back, you will see that you get a lot of traction on, on everything. So sign into Medium. All right. That's what it says. It says, this link will expire in a couple of hours. All right. Let me see. Let me see. Okay, Medium. Trying to be great. All right, so just give me one second. This thing is just moving a little bit slow, not normal. For some reason, see, it's not, it's not coming up. So this one won't work. This Do one won't work. Do you need one of my email addresses? Yeah, give me um, one that you didn't, you haven't used. Uh, my Gmail one. And no, no, that's my Yahoo. So, no, you're hold on. You got it. At Gmail. All right, so don't be emailing us. <laughs> Please. All right, so click on continue. All right, so when you click on continue here. Now I need to go on my email on my phone. Yeah, and then you're gonna have to verify it. Just verify it on your end. Create account. Oh my goodness. All right, just, just, just leave it right there. All right, let me let me let me just use my Facebook. Hang on one second. Let me use my Facebook. You can you can set that up later. All right, so here we go. This is all live training, guys. So you gotta, you know, we ain't gonna edit no anything and make it all fancy dancy. Just gotta sit through training like this. 
because it's all live. All right. So I'm going to go through the good stuff. So this is what happened when you see all the pretty YouTube videos and they, they jump through it. They edit out a lot of their videos. So don't think they're <laughs> doing something quick or showing you something quick. <laughs> Just saying. There's a lot of time in between. All right. <laughs> so right here, as you can see, it's medium. You can come on over here. You can create, create a medium profile. Once you create the profile, you, I can go over to uh, view profile. When I click on brew profile, I can go edit all these things and make it all pretty. So I can click on get unlimited access. I can go edit my profile. I can go to home. Because once you once you 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 create it, it's going to ask you what do you want to create your your um, medium about. It's called a medium blog. And you just got to walk through the process. It's it's pretty easy. It's very, you just got to, yeah, it's very straightforward. All right. So once you do that, let's say we're going to write. So we're going to write. You click on that little tab at the bottom you want to write. I'm just, I'm just showing all these things. So here's how this thing works. It's pretty cool. So if you want to put title, let's say you want to type in, Let's say you want to buy in May. Okay. My, no. My dog loves bones. <laughs> bones. But no, I love bones only on Sundays and Mondays. Mondays. <laughs> Hey, listen, we're just making stuff really bold. So this is what it looks like. Now, if you want to make it bold, you can highlight it. You can highlight and you can click on here where it says bold. Whoops. If you watch the Canva tutorial I did last week, you're going to find a lot of the same things. Yeah, it's basically the same thing. So if you haven't watched that, go and watch it because you missed out. <laughs> and then right here where it says you can talk about your story, you can start writing. You can say my, oops. Mondays. All right. So this is good. Hit enter. My pup loves bones. Whatever. So you can start writing. If you're a writer, write a lot. Use a lot of keyword research. There's a great website that is called. Clarify what you just. So I know you just said keyword research, and I know we've just talked about that, yeah. but just clarify again what that means. So keyword research is what people are looking for, so, what people are searching for. So use that same website that I just shared with you. So that's why you want to do Google, Google Trends, Trends and Google Analytics. Yeah, and start looking for words. You know, start looking for words that people are looking for. Once you find those words, then you can make a longer tail keywords because longer tail keywords will get you in the search engine. What are longer <laughs> what are longer tail keywords? These are just longer phrases that is around that specific keyword. So you don't want to, um, if you're going to use a hashtag, you just don't want to use just dog because there's going to be millions of people going to be searching for dogs. That's not going to make you on the top of that yeah. search engine list, which is why we showed you those other websites to begin with because you want to do your research before you start writing because if you do your research, it's going to benefit you more in the long run. There you go. So you could just do that. And you can go in here. One thing you don't want to do, you don't want to just grab a raw affiliate link. You don't want to just go to ClickBank, grab the hop link and just put it over here. That will, you know, that will get your account banned. It's going to be a violation of medium.com and all that kind of stuff. So you can create a domain name. What is a domain? A domain of, we, we talk about it. We have in, a training on a domain video and there's a training on what he just meant by ClickBank and hop link. Yeah, so. in our Facebook group, Yes. by the way. So right here, you know, you could just write it out and everything. Yes. <laughs> Let me just do that. If you want to add a picture, you can click on here. You can go here. You can, you can a add a picture. You can add a video. So I'm going to put you Brett. So look, see, I just had a picture. And there she is right there. <laughs> this is when I look normal. You know, <laughs> she's right there. So that's her. You can add a picture. If you want to add a video, you can also add a video. You can click on here, so you can um, add a add an image with an uns, from unsplash. unsplash. 
you can add a video you know so if you want to put a video in there you can add youtube as well you can embed a lot of different things inside of there and then you can you know when you come down here again you can just click on this whoops you can start writing you know start writing and let's say you want to change this you want to put all that stuff that it looks pretty you want to change this font you want to change these size you want to put in like your affiliate link however you don't want to just put the raw link of whatever affiliate program that you want to promote make sure you get an, a domain name create a landing page so that way you don't get flagged so that's very very important so and as you just saw like how he highlighted that what the heck is this called we're going to call it a chain like that's also what i showed you in canva so once you you're gonna start seeing very similar things. So I do recommend, again, if you have not watched that Canva training, do it because it's gonna be beneficial when you're doing Medium, if that's the path you decide to go. That's cool. And then once you do that, you know, after you're done, you just come over here and just click publish. Publish it. And when you click on publish, you will see where it says, all right, one final thing. Do you wanna add some hashtags? You have up to five of different topics you want your story to be about. So let's say we're talking about dogs. I can type in dog right here. As you can see, 44,000 people searching for this. This one, dog training. There's Dorch coin. That's crypto. Dog food, all that stuff. So I will click on dog food. I'll go to dog training. No dog training. Do that as well. Okay, dog training. Is that methods? See that? Not a lot of people searching for these things. So these would get you up into the search engine because, again, people are not. So you have five of these, and when you're done, you hit on publish, and it goes out there. Or if you're a person who wants to batch out your content, let's say you said, all right, Sundays, this is what I'm going to focus on because maybe you have a full-time job. Maybe you have two to three jobs that you have going on. Maybe you have kids, and you get tired by the time 9 o'clock come or 9.30, <laughs> and you want to go to sleep, and you want to take one day to say, all right, this is the day that I'm going to focus on and you can just botch out everything and then you can schedule it out for the entire week. He said, all right, Monday, it's going to go out at eight, Tuesday, eight, Wednesday, eight, boom, boom, boom. So that way you stay consistent Hold because on. you have to stay consistent. Before you move on, there's two things I want to add to what you just said. So first off, explain to them just a little bit because this is going to be helpful if they decide to do other platforms where hashtags are. Explain to them briefly, even though you typed in a hashtag that was like 45,000, why should they choose the lower one compared to the higher one? You said they would show up in the search engine better, but just explain that a little bit more real quickly. Very good. So the reason why you want to use hashtags or, you know, whether it's on, you want to use hashtag for your video content, if you go on YouTube, Instagram, Twitter, LinkedIn, all that stuff, because your account is smaller, you don't want to compete with the bigger accounts because bigger accounts, they already flooded all the, 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 the search engine that has the millions of searches already. So, for example, if I want to grow an Instagram account or I want to grow a, um, a, a TikTok account, I will never use a hashtag that has millions. I will go and search for different hashtags that have thousands and hundreds and no more than 10,000 because when I use those, then it's going to help me to get show up on the Explorer pages. It's going to get me to get more feed because these platforms are going to say, all right, hey, Here's a, here's a little creator, a little creator that wants to put their stuff out there. Let me just shoot it out to people who's looking for this stuff. So that way you don't get lost when you try to use bigger hashtags. There you go. And one more thing, like he was just, this doesn't really have to do with medium, but whereas he was just talking about the schedule for later part, with affiliate marketing, with anything you're trying to do online, a lot of people do work full-time jobs, okay? We get that. We both used to work full-time jobs. But the thing is, if you want this bad enough, you're not going to use time as an excuse. You have to schedule time out, whether it's once a week, maybe you schedule time out before you go to bed at night, but you have to have that scheduled time or you're never going to progress. If you're just like, eh, I'll get to it later in the week, guess what? You're not going to get to it later in the week, all right? Never if you have a husband, a wife, girlfriend, boyfriend, kids, whatever it is, 
like our son, obviously our one-year-old doesn't know any different, but our son knows like if daddy's in his office and his door's closed, he's working. If mommy's in her office and her door's closed, she's working. So just, you have to set those boundaries with your yeah, family yeah. so you can get that work done. Because if you don't do that, you're going to keep staying stuck where you are right now. Yeah, you have to, you gotta, you gotta, you know, everybody gotta come together as a family and you're going to sit down and you say, Hey, hubby, listen to you. Every night at this time, I'm going to focus on my thing. So they have a clear mindset that you're going to go focus on and you're not wasting time. You're doing something productive. A lot of, if you want to know how much time you're wasting, pull out the app on Facebook, pull out the app on TikTok and pull out the app on Instagram. And I want you to pull it up and go to the section where it says analytics. And you're going to see how much time you spend per day just scrolling through meaningless content posts that or you, commenting on the yeah, same video that you that, commented that, on is, that is not necessary anyways let's get rolling i just i had to add that in because it's important we have to we have to all right so i'm going to share my screen again and i'm going to show you a website where we did talk about this in the past we're going to talk about it again so let's say you want to talk about um different you can find royalty free videos on here so if you let's say you're talking about dog and you want to find dog and cat videos or dog training or whatever. As you can see, if I click on here, I will see a bunch of different videos and images. So I got videos, I got photos, and I could search for all these little cute things. So these are royalty free content that is free to use. You ain't going to get in trouble for it. You ain't going to get copyright because I know people always worry about that. That's why they create this. They create this for creators. Creators post their pictures on here for people to use and in exchange they're hoping that someone will give them a dollar to really use their content most times i'll leave a dollar or so because i know it's hard work and that's how they make their money so hey if you can leave somebody else give them a dollar for their picture ain't nothing wrong with that it's a dollar it'll come back to you, you know? trust us yeah it's gonna come back tenfold so you can come on here you can download it it is free you can use videos on here so you can add that to your medium.com and make it look pretty, okay? So the next thing that I want to do also, I want to share with you, so we already talked about this. Now, if you are not quite sure how to write, because I know some of you said, well, I don't know how to write. Well, if you don't know how to write, don't worry. I got you covered. That's why I said stay till the end so I can share this with you. Now, I'm going to share with you this website that is absolutely free. And oh, what's that word again? Free. <laughs> it's called plrplr.com. So plrplr.com, right here, as you can see, it says free PLR article directory. Oops. Now, when you come on here, because it's free, these are royalty free information that you can use. So you can come on here and you can find anything under the sun if you're not quite sure what you wanna do. You can come on here, but just make sure that you give credit to the rightful owners. Because if you don't get credit to them, and guess they find what? out. They're gonna <laughs> shut you down. So you wanna come over here. If you wanna talk about boat, if you wanna talk about painting, if you're someone who's interested in uh, candle making, all the ladies, I know you love candle making. If you wanna talk about cats, if you wanna talk about carpets, you get the idea what I'm trying to share with you. So anything that you want to talk about is here. So as we're talking about dogs, I'm sure if I go in here, yeah. there we go. Yeah. There's going to be dogs. So if I click on dogs, guess what? There's going to be articles about dogs. So let me zoom this in so you all can see. General history of dogs. This article right now average 3.94 out of 5. And I scroll down, this article gets a 3.7. So if you're someone who says, well, I really don't know what to write, you can come on here and you can get general ideas about how to write these things. Or if you're like just feeling stuck in general, like go look because sometimes if I'm feeling stuck, I'll just search something and then something will pop up and it'll give me an idea. So if you're just having like a mental block, you don't have to come here to use it. Just go and get an idea and it will help you get you out of that block. Yeah, good idea. Some of, some of the time when we can make content what do you think we you think we're google 
No, we use Google. <laughs> I'll go on there and I search for some stuff, get some ideas, and I said, all right, I can use this and create a video. So just come on over here and search. You can search. Um, this one is a 3.58. If I click on this, um, decorative deer hound, you never heard of that before. Interesting. See? So maybe the, you know, the people who are into these things can find this fascinating. So all this right here, let me see if I could zoom in. I'm gonna zoom in a little bit. I can go over here, I can read it. I can go through the entire thing. I can copy everything that is here and right down here, right down here where it says, where is it? Oops, click here to convert, click here to convert free PLR into 100% unique content. So that means you can make it in your own unique content if you want. So if I click on this, once I click on it, it's going to take me to article. Let me see. Okay, there we go. See all this stuff? So I can come on here. This is an investment in your future, right? So there we go. Sometimes these people are selling these things. So you can. Oh my gosh! And up south, I'm gonna run. No, right. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Inside joke. Yeah. Right. Oh, it's a it's an upsell. What do you think? You ain't gonna give away this number free. So you have all this information right here. There's two things. You can just copy it and give give uh, credit to the rightful owner. They always put it at the bottom down here. Um, bookmark the permanent. Oh, there you go. This. So that's a permalink. So you can copy this entire permalink, and then when you use it, you know, when you... When, yeah, there it is. Now you can click on it. Yeah, you know, you can click on that, and then you could use it. And it says comments close. But make sure you give credit to the owners, right? You have to give credit to the owners. Otherwise, they're going to... Man, they ain't going to be happy. And they will just shut you down right away. Don't want to deal with legal so action. give credit. <laughs> Definitely give credit. So again, come on here. You can search for different things. Where you can find products, again, you can go to clickbank.com. You can find products over there. All right, so you can go to clickbank.com. I have, I have a few different accounts on ClickBank. You can go to affiliates, and you will see all this stuff. And ClickBank is free. I know sometimes they will say, hey, um, you can go through their training. I think they have like a training. I think recently people are asking about that. And I'm like, no, you don't need to go through that. If you want some training, we got some training, we can point you in the right direction so you can go there. So once you log in, you can find your different products. Um, I wonder if I can log in into an account here. Hmm. Let me see. Um, probably, I have, a, I have a few different accounts. That I can, okay, there we go. Reporting live. Okay. So, all right, this account is running. This account is running. Oh, cool. So I got, um, so you can go to Marketplace. And when you go to Marketplace, after you go to Marketplace, you can find your products on here. So you can go search for whatever it is. You can search for green products. You can go to health and fitness. You can, whatever you, whatever you want to write your blog about. But again, do not copy the link from here and put it onto your blog because you they need will, a domain. Yeah, you're going to need a domain. You need to create a capture page. We already talked about those videos, so you can go back and go check that out. So we have a great place in the, I think that was the time for us to, do you want to do a little, re, um, you want to do a, a quick little tutorial of how to use the group real quick? Yeah, I'll just take two yeah. seconds. You have to use, use your mouse. Your... I don't, I don't use mouse, so I'll just tell you where to go. All right. So we're going to give you a quick little splash of Rudy's of where to find Just things. because, and here's the thing, Facebook is constantly changing. So it's like, if something changes, I'll make a post, but sometimes I just, I don't have the time of day to redo every single video when Facebook changes something every single day. 
Yeah, so and, and bear it, with and, us if something's not in the spot that it should be in. And it's not only Facebook, it's with everything. Yeah. I could create a video about click funnels right now and they change it tomorrow. Yeah. Okay, so right here, as soon as you're in the group, click on this where your mouse is. This right here is where just click on that for me. So Friendly this is where resources. all the videos we have done, they are all right here. It says what they are and every specific link is right here. Okay. So that's that you can, in this video, we're going to add it up here too. Yeah. So, so see. see, but I can't really, I'm going to have to just do one from my phone because guides is showing here. If you are on your phone and you come to this main page of the group on the upper left hand corner, there's going to be three lines. And when you click on that, you're then able to access the guides. There is the, um, the free checklist for beginners and there's, some other stuff that we talk about. So don't miss out on that because there's more information in there for you. But again, it used to be on the top of Facebook and they moved it and it's like sort of hidden now. It took me a couple weeks to find it. Yeah, it's, they, they change stuff a lot. Yeah. And if you're on your computer, you just go but to guys. Anything important will always be in the feature tab at the top of the group. Yeah. So we're going to add this on here and, and, and when you go through it, you know, feel free to come in under here as well. So we know that you actually going through the information and everything would appreciate it because there's 2,500 of you on here. And right now there's only six. We of only you had nine people watching, which is <laughs> we're, you know, we're honest. If you've been watching us, it's pathetic. We're giving you so much free information yeah. and there was nine people watching, but Hey, it's it. your gain and their loss. All right. Hey, you know, I'm, I'm, we're, we're still going to be over here getting rich. You know, <laughs> that's all I know. <laughs> we're, we're, so you can either keep up with time or get left behind. Pretty simple. So let me stop sharing our screen. Do you want to share anything, anything you want to? Rick had a, a question, so I don't know if you want to. I just saw it pop up. All right. Hey, what's going on, Rick? So Rick's saying I'm having a problem finding where to put my link for a product. What do you mean exactly you're having a problem to put my link for a product? What do you mean by that? If you could clarify, I'll definitely answer. So and that, sometimes that there's wasn't a clear. little big, a bit of a lag, too. Yeah. That wasn't clear, so no. I'm not quite sure. I did a domain yeah. and name cheap that, and it takes 72. Yeah, that's great. Yeah. So they they do take, you know, sometimes they'll take it 24 hours. Sometimes it, it takes you like six hours. Sometimes it takes you. Geez. Sometimes they'll say a time and it's less or sometimes they'll say a time and it's more. But Okay, I'm having a problem find, to find where to put my link for the product that's and nice. on, on the website websites do you do you get it no can you jump on a live <laughs> i don't know if you can do all i don't know wait can you no you have to have stream yard okay yeah oh it, we could have if it was an actual facebook live send this link to guess if you also want to share instruction yeah, but then I think they have to sign up and everything, right? I don't even know. Websites. I'm not even sure what websites. If you're watching this outside of our group and you haven't joined the group yet, like websites, I'm going to leave all, okay. the, so all the information. Like in websites group. are other places to add it. So I think, are you saying, Rick, you're just like, you don't know where. So for example, like Andre just showed Medium. I don't know when you joined in, but like, are you saying like which platform you should share it on? That might be what he's saying. Probably. I'm not sure. Sorry, we're trying to understand. Yeah. <laughs> so if you're, if you're, if, if, if that's what you're, you're probably saying, um, where to put your link to your product. Um, people created Instagram account. Yeah. Okay. See, you know, I'm, I'm good. People, I knew. <laughs> people create Instagram account. People create TikTok account. I just did a video, uh, an entire video. So maybe you came in late. So after this, this video will be uploaded. Yep. So you can go back. So we, we, the reason why we do this is because we know a lot of people don't want to put themselves on. They don't want to make videos. They're afraid of making videos. And even though we create this, some people will get this information and they still don't make a, a medium because they think that, well, I don't know what to write about. I'm not quite sure. Well, go Google. Go Google some stuff, get some inspiration, and then input it. 
Yeah, Rick. So like what he's saying, if you did miss this training, you can go back because Medium could be a resource. Um, maybe we've also done, I did a training on Facebook groups and Facebook business page. So that's another source. If you're an Instagram guy or Pinterest, or if you want to do a YouTube channel. So if you're first starting out, our biggest recommendation is you just focus on one platform. Like you don't want to go sign up for Instagram and Facebook and TikTok. Like that's just too overwhelming. And you will, you will fail faster if you try to do that. <laughs> like you want to do one thing. So and get comfortable first. Yeah. You yeah. Gotta get comfortable, get into the zone, trying to figure out how things work yeah. before you start being all over the place. Yeah, so, it could be challenging. Yeah. It could be very challenging. So definitely go to that feature tab we just mentioned at the top of the group and you can see our list of resources and there's about, I think on it, four or five different places we may talk about. Yeah. Um, but yeah, you definitely, you want to start off with what you're comfortable with. You want to get familiar with it. Like, as I said, choose one platform before you um, start going on more yeah. is what I'm trying to say. Yeah, out. absolutely. <laughs> Kay. You know, um, it is. Um, and we, we're not saying it, it isn't. It's the same way when we started to. It's very intimidating because there's a lot of things on the internet and you're wondering, man, is it possible? Can I actually do it? And I'm here to tell you that you can. Like each and every one of you watching this video, whether you're watching the live replay or whatever, you can go out there. You can create a life for yourself. You can make this work. You can make a ton of money and go retire on a beach somewhere. It is possible. Every day people are doing it. You know, we didn't think it was possible for us too, but we did it. it <laughs> I worked. doubted it. You know, so uh, as long as, you know, I, 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 I understand when people say, well, I have to I have to see it first to believe that I can make money online. And that's the wrong way of doing it. If you don't believe that you can make money online, it doesn't matter what I say. I could be up here and give you what my website look like. I can give you my password for my account. And I said, here you go. Go out there and go make money. If you don't believe it you're never going to achieve it. So the first thing that you have to do is believe that you can actually do something. And then once you believe that you could do it, then yes, everything is going to fall in place. I believe that I believe that we were going to do it when she didn't believe it. I said, you don't have to believe, but I know I'm going to be because I already believe it, right? So if you want to be a six-figure earner or a seven-figure earner, if you don't, if you don't have the mindset to say, okay, I'm already making seven figures online or six figures or even a thousand dollars online, you're never gonna get there because your mind is already telling you that you can't do it. So that's the one thing that you have to do. You have to already prepare your mindset to be there, that you're already making the money, that money is flowing in your bank account every single day. That's the mentality that you have to go when it comes to it. Even if you have no idea what you're doing. You just want to believe that you're already doing it. Already. And the thing is, if you're watching this video right now, you're all you're already way ahead of everybody else in this group of all 2,500 people. <laughs> like you're already ahead. Like you're learning. You're educating yourself. You just have to go out and take that first step. Like it's scary, but you have to go do it because if you don't do it, you're just gonna, as I said earlier, you're gonna keep being stuck. Um, Rick was asking if we do have an Instagram training. Did we do any Instagram training? You have a course on how to do it on Instagram. So I feel like you really can just, uh, so for me, because we've been doing this for so long now, like I feel like something I post on Facebook, like if it's in a paragraph or something, like I could just go post it to my Instagram. Like you want to make content again, this is when you are comfortable enough to go on to more than one platform. Yeah. You want to make content that you can cross promote cross post. Yeah. Evergreen content. Yeah. You want to do evergreen stuff. And the reason why you want to do evergreen content is because you want to be able to transfer them to different locations and you want evergreen content. That's going to be there for a long time. So like this video that we have right here that we create, this is an evergreen content. Even if three, four years ago, maybe the features on medium will change. But the content and the information is still relevant. It's still going to be relevant. And sort of also too touching on Rick, you created good conversation. Um, what Rick's talking about. So you before you even think about what platform you want to go on, you have to find your niche and your target audience first. Because if you don't do that first, you may start on a platform that's not going to work for that niche or that target audience. Like 
I've always been a Facebook girl. I sort of ventured out into the Instagram world. It's sort of, it's rocky. Facebook is my like Facebook is my jam, but that's where my niche is, my target audience is. So you have to figure those out before you decide on what platform you want to go on. Yeah. So you want to do that. Um, Kay, I love these conversations. So she says she deleted an old Instagram I had and then attached my new page mm -hmm. on it. Yeah, that's cool. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, because you, know, yeah, you, you can only yeah. have one page attached. Yeah, you, you can you can either delete it or you can create a new one. That's yeah. totally cool. I have at one point I have or I had over six or seven different Instagram account because Instagram is my thing. You know, she's a yeah. Facebook thing. I'm an Instagram. So as you can see, I his target audience is not, way different than my target audience. Not everybody <laughs> likes the same thing. So I could be up here talking about Instagram and Facebook. It could be a gem or TikTok. So it doesn't matter. You can use the same information. So Instagram is my thing. You know, at one point I was making Instagram account and I was selling them. You know, I used to sell Instagram account for 500 bucks. I used to sell Instagram account for $1,000. So you probably think that this information that we're teaching is just a waste of time. But you can take the information here and just run with it. Like the Instagram accounts that I used to, man, I used to make a lot of money. People used to pay me $25 just to post one, one picture for 24 hours. And as soon as the 24 hours is over, I delete it. <laughs> and that's why like when we talk about affiliate marketing like i don't know if you join this group because of my video or his video <clears throat> probably my video no i'm just <laughs> but anyways um my point to that being now i just lost my point because i was being smart ass what was i gonna say <laughs> always being a smart <laughs> what was i just gonna say i don't know i don't know either oh affiliate marketing like it opens the door to so many opportunities like he can grow Instagram accounts and sell them to people to have their business already going. And then they build off of that. Like you just don't know what you can do, what you could do if you haven't started doing affiliate marketing. You can make a lot of money on the internet. Trust me. And you don't have to either if you don't want to. My new favorite phrase is you can earn. You, you have to earn that money. Yeah. You can make it, but you have to earn it. You have to earn it. You got to put in the work, man. I remember a guy paid me a hundred bucks just to open up a Facebook account. I was like, oh my goodness. And you guys, that's a hundred dollars. You start like, somebody just paid me a hundred dollars just to open up a face a Facebook account. It didn't even take me two seconds to even put it together and I got a hundred bucks. My old so <laughs> if you watch the previous training on the group in the Facebook business page, my old boss, the one I fired, I she used to pay me because I did it a year before I quit my job, but she used to pay me. I built their business page. I was the one posting. I was the one doing live. So maybe you even have a job in whatever that job is. Maybe that's something you can do for your boss. Maybe you don't want to fire your boss. Maybe you don't want to leave your career, but you yeah. still want to do this. That's totally fine. That's cool. But once you learn this, you're going to be able to do stuff for other businesses that they can't do or they just don't want to do. You have options because a lot of people... They don't have time for it. So I don't know where you work right now, but you could see if they got an Instagram page or they have a, a Facebook page. Maybe you could cut a deal out and say, hey, listen, I can take this over. You could pay pay me 500 bucks a month. I could run this for you. That's money right there, you know? I was not charging my boss enough at the time. <laughs> yeah, you were, you were lowballing. I was. Guys, yeah. I was only charging. <laughs> I'm not even going to tell you what I was charging her. Just Well, when we, <laughs> that's when we... When we first started, well, if it was now, oh, now, yeah. no, I was only <laughs> guys, I was only charging her $10 an hour to do what I was doing. Oh, the yes. amount of money I would charge somebody now. And that's the thing. Don't be afraid to charge people what you're worth. Right now, if somebody don't have $3,000 from them to if they're on their Facebook or their Instagram account, don't even message me. Yeah. Don't and, even call me. Yeah. And I guess, you know, let's close it out with this. So on the topic of that, people ask us, do we do one-on-one -on -one trainings? Guys, unfortunately, the answer is no. The reason the answer is no is because our kids take priority. Our son starts kindergarten next week. Don't want to talk about it because I'm going to end up crying again. But our kids take priority. One of the main reasons we still do this to this day and we will do it forever so we can constantly be present in their lives, which is why people, if they're asking us for the basics or fundamentals, we will send you to our mentor because our yeah. mentor is who taught that's where, us. That's where we learn how to do it. So it's basically we're, 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 gi we're giving you the information, right? We want to share this with you. We want to share it with you. And once you learn that, 
then guess what? You can go out there and you can create a lifestyle for yourself as well. So if most of you have no clue where to start and you want to get started, you can comment down below or we could show or click on the link in the description or whatever. And you can get started. Like, don't waste time. You know, the time that you're sitting around and you're sitting on your hands, you could be further along. Like, we didn't waste time when we started. Well, because, I did. You didn't. You know, <laughs> it's it's a lot of information. And if you can get all the information in one place, it's just a big, it's just a starting point. Like maybe down the road when our kids no longer want us and they're out of the house, we probably will offer something one-on-one. -on -one. But right now, if we were to do that, I would be charging a lot of money. Yeah. A or, lot. Or if you got some money in your, under your mattress. That's the type of money. Like there's no amount of money is worth taking time away from my kids. So let's just put it that way. Yeah. All right, are we good? We're good. We're we good. love you guys, man, and thank yes. you so much. Thank you, you for know, watching. We'll see you guys soon. We'll probably do a training next week or probably won't. We don't know yet. We'll see how it goes. So because we don't want to give too much information and then you guys are not able to get caught up. Yeah. So I think we're going to we're going to start to put something together like if if the information if you haven't used this information, we're not going to provide anything new. Because we have a lot, we have a lot of information. A lot. And you know, we don't want, because you are beginners, we don't want to overwhelm you. Like the stuff we have given you already in the past, what is this, our seven, eight? I don't even know how many videos we've done. It's a lot. So we don't want to overwhelm you because then if we overwhelm you, you're just really not going to take any action and we want you to take action. So we almost might have to take a little... A little hiatus. Or maybe, we'll still be we'll, here. Yeah, we'll, but, we'll jump on a live. Yeah. We'll just jump on for probably five minutes. Be like, hey, what's going on? What have you done? You know? Or we'll do a Q and A, right? Yeah, we'll, do, we'll we probably do, do a, a, yeah, a Q and A next week. Yeah, we'll, you know, question and answers, and we'll probably, if anybody want to jump on live and talk to us, we're more than happy. Yeah, so I that's, think that's like what a, we should do. That's like your free coaching. Yeah, you know? your free coaching. You can come on live with us and don't be afraid. You know, don't be shy. You're you're talking to us. You're talking to two real people. So we'll do a QA. Yeah, next definitely week. a QA. I don't know why this is showing like there's been a few of them. Yeah. So if a... someone has been commenting, we can't see them on our phones, but on our screen. So we're not ignoring you. It just says Facebook user. We can't see who you are. Yeah. So whoever is here, I know I saw Rick and I saw Kay. And of course Cecilia, oh, Cecilia. Our, our main girl. And yeah. that's and VIP. I and Dottie, yeah. yeah. Dottie is always here too. You know, Dottie's always listening in. Yes. So, yeah, anybody who's on here, you know, we appreciate you. Whether you decide to comment or not, use this information. Thank you so much. We'll catch you on the next live. So, bye guys. Have a good night.